I'm James Hill here in Venice where sea turtle nesting runs March through October. Experts say funding grants are available to help make sure sea turtles reach the water. Through this grant, we are retrofitting uh, fixtures and bulbs that are visible from the beach with wildlife friendly alternatives. And these are going to be fixtures that are mounted um, as low to the ground as possible using lower watts and lumens. Experts say funding grants from the National Fish and Wildlife Gulf Environmental Benefit Fund can help properly upgrade lighting along the Sun Coast to help the turtle population survive naturally. Emily Woodley says Sharky's, a restaurant near the Venice Pier, is now using retrofitted lighting through this grant. Sea turtles are um, attracted to shorter wavelengths of light. So under natural conditions, they're going to use the darkened silhouettes of the dunes as opposed to uh, the light that's going to be reflecting off of the water from natural uh, conditions such as the moon and stars, and they'll make their way to the water. However, landward sources of light are going to disrupt these natural cues and they're going to head inland instead of towards the water. To learn more about Sea Turtle Conservancy, log on to our website at mysuncoast.com. Reporting from Venice, I'm James Hill with ABC7, your local station.